Okay, so this is the image CCD camera instrument driver. It works with the uh, Q Imaging CCD camera. And at this moment the um, driver is off. To, uh, you can run the driver independently or you can run the driver in the principal program. So you press uh, run. We're going to run it independently. Independent CCD choose OK. Now the program is running. In order to view pictures you press preview on off. You see the acquiring button here turns on so this is when you're getting images. This is a live image as you can see when we focus. So we have the exit button here <coughs> to exit the program. Let's run it again. You have the configure button here to set up the priorities of this instrument driver for the operating system and also to save any value of the controls in the program. You have the script based automation controls like uh, in any instrument driver. So let's put the image on. Here you have the type of the image you can choose. Uh, you have the exposure time so every time you change the exposure you have to press the update button so now less exposure you have darker color. Uh, you have the binning which gives you the quality of the image so if you set binning 1 update it's going to give you a better image when this indicator here turns red, it's because the program cannot keep up with the um, acquisition rate. So basically you tell him to go at a lower frame rate per second. Um, so now it's going at 5 frames per second and you see that it's, it can keep up with the, uh, the acquisition rate. Which means that uh, the, the image is truly 5 frames per second. Um, anytime you want to save a picture, you press this button. Anyone, uh, anyone, uh, anytime you want to save a movie, you press this button. And the movies and the pictures they go into this folder here. So press it to set to set the the folder where the information will be saved. Once you choose the folder, you press current folder, and now this current folder is going to be registered uh, in this control here. This is going to be the name of the file. Uh, which will be integrated in the um, name that it's going to be composed by the program. It's going to uh, contain the date and the time the, f the file has been created, as well as the name. This button here to control the uh, image. Um, you can do measurement with this tool, and you can uh, zoom out and if you press shift control uh, control uh, if you press the shift key it's gonna go into the minus so you're gonna diminish the image basically this and these are the tools we're using and when you do measurements you need to calibrate the camera so you have a table of numbers this is the objective for X this is the calibration factor 4x plus 1.5 this is the calibration factor and so on normally we're working at 60x with this calibration factor and uh, 4x with this calibration factor actually it's 4x with this calibration factor um, according to the type of the objective well, every time you do measurements on the screen you see this uh, distance here in pixels and in microns changes so this is how uh, you do measurements measurements are normally done at binning 1 uh, and the calibration factors should be measured at binning 1 
Cool.